And I want to say that Mori is back. Which is the joy of Walter Mongare Alias Nyambane after he was issued the presidential nomination certificate by the IEBC. To him, this is the beginning of yet another task of looking for support from Kenyans as the election date nears. And this is a victory for all of us. I want to tell every young man who's out there, every young woman, and every Kenyan, that dream and start to dream. And when you dream, please wake up and follow that dream. Today, Professor George Wajakoya of Ruth's party also appeared before the Wafula Chibukati led body for the presidential registration exercise. And even though he failed to raise the requisite 2,000 signatures in at least 24 counties, he has until 2nd of June to accomplish the same. The, we have the data, so you're just going to go back and add so that we can satisfy the commission's requirement. Here, the controversial university Don is confident that we'll achieve the same. Take your application for today and uh, give you an opportunity on the uh, 2nd of June at 3 p.m. if you have that chance to correct the, the anomalies. If you get everything which is very clean, something is wrong somewhere. At least if there is a mistake that has happened or there is some kind of uh, um, shortfall, we are going to do it because you have seen, witnessed that we have passed everything. Apart from one thing, I'm not going to go to Tafanya if you. Drama was however witnessed at the Bombers of Kenya earlier this morning after Muranga County Governor and Usawa Party Presidential Hopeful Mwangi Wairia supporters blocked the entrance declaring the removal of Wairia's name in the nomination list. Now, now after we have cornered them, today they have written a note saying nothing, telling us we didn't conform. And they are not specifying the conformities. So I'm writing back to them asking what are the conformities. So I'm going to push it all the way and if they refuse my cardiac, this party will convert into a resistance movement. It is an exercise which is said to come to an end on the 6th of June, after which the successful applicants will be issued with the presidential nomination certificates. The vetting process for presidential hopefuls has entered day two here at the Bombers of Kenya, and as the election nears, many are optimistic that they will be on the ballot come 9th of August. Majibu Kitsao K24 TV at the Bombers of Kenya, Nairobi.